<laughs> Good morning from Hong Kong. Today is day four. It's bright and early, and it's time to go to Macau. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> Delayed reaction. No coffee yet, and uh, it's not even 7 a.m. So uh, yeah, it, I think this is the earliest we're up. <laughs> let's see if the uh, MTR is open, and uh, let's make our way to the Hong Kong Ferry Pier. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let's go. Okay, so to get by, we rely on our trusty TST station. I don't think I've ever seen it this empty before. Cool, empty. So Jenny, what do you know about Macau? Macau? Yeah. Gambling. All right. <laughs> so we're going to Las Vegas in Asia. Yes, they call it Las Vegas in Asia, um, Europe in Asia. Apparently there's two ways to get to Macau. So the uh, Ferry Pier will rely on a turbo jet, which is kind of like, um, what's that boat people take to get around like to Bohol? Roro? Um, yeah, I think it's like Roro. Yeah, it's like a speed jet or something, mm. right? Okay, take two. We didn't need to take the ramp. The train's actually this way. So we're just turning around. We've been taking this train every day. We still get lost. <laughs> yeah, so trying to film and uh, walk and chew gum, I guess. So anyways, uh, maybe we should recap. How was your day yesterday? Oh, yesterday was so long. So I met a friend from the Philippines. It's so funny because um, we haven't met for like in a while in the Philippines. But then we met in Hong Kong, so it was fun. And where'd you go? Oh, we went to Lantau Island, but not for Disneyland. Oh, oh, Jay, don't tumble over. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, nobody else here. <laughs> yes, you went to Lanto Island. Yeah, we went to Lanto Island and we visited the Big Buddha. And you know the experience, the car. The cable cars. Uh, the cable cars. Oh my God, it's just like the best experience ever. It's like nothing in this world. I think we have some good reaction videos, so yeah. we'll try to share some of that. Yes. Okay. So, yeah, pretty much uh, we spent like our majority of our time th there yesterday well besides food crawl <laughs> so far i don't think we've had uh one bad meal right they've all been pretty good yeah yeah so uh, yesterday i thought it was kind of fun to show people some of the things we tried earlier mm -hmm. and that's the michelin star pan fried buns yes and the um the famous egg tai chong tart. egg tarts yeah so i think they were a hit for the most part yeah, I'm, I'm excited to try the Portuguese egg tart in Macau today. Yeah, that would be something new for both of us. Hey, some place new. Shake one. So we want to find exit. Oh, you already found it. Okay, exit D. I got you. Okay, Macau Ferry Terminal. Yeah. All right. Straight. I still have sixty dollars in my octopus card. I hope I can still go back to Hong Kong <laughs> with sixty dollars. Ain't that the ferry? I don't know what that is. But how do we get there? I don't know. Sarah, if you're watching this, sorry. We were talking too much, so we kind of got lost again. <laughs> <laughs> so what's the process of buying a ticket or what are we doing exactly so we just bought a ticket round trip actually because today is weekend okay so there might be you know we might not be able to buy tickets anymore later so we bought an 8 30 going to macau and then 5 30 going back to hong kong okay so right now we're trying to figure out how to do the immigration by the way, guys, these With are the Mahals. Mahals. Good morning, Mahals. <laughs> Wave. Hi, good morning. Good morning, lovely Gundas. <laughs> <laughs> okay, apparently we have to do the departure cards. You have to fill out the uh, arrival card when you get back to Hong Kong. That's yeah. It. That's all you have to do. Oh, okay. He, he, she mentioned about passport. Just make sure you bring your departure card from Hong Kong. Yeah. Oh, okay. Luckily for us, we didn't run into any trouble at immigration and it went pretty smoothly. Here you can see the cost of the ticket, which is 175 Hong Kong dollars for one way. And that works out to about 2,500 pesos for a round trip or about $45 USD. And look just how excited Jenny is here to go to Macau for the very first time. We both have never been out there before. 
Yep, and you can see me there trying to find my balance because it was kind of wobbly and yeah, we're just trying to find our seats. Well, it wasn't difficult because it's labeled properly. We're rolling in economy. <laughs> Oh my god, this is so dizzying. I forgot how dizzying ferry is, actually. Yeah. But you'll get used to it. It's just because it's the first, like, five minutes. Yeah. But you'll get used to it. So, it's pretty wide, huh? Yeah. It's pretty and spacious. It's cold. There's a lot of people. Mm -hmm. And it's actually clean. I think if you get the, um, the upgrade, the premium, you actually get to board upstairs. Yeah, but it's, like, twice the price, too, right? Well, if you're rich, then you can get that. BGC yeah. Dreams, on the other hand, hasn't been uploading videos. <laughs> <laughs> we have arrived. <laughs> Will my octopus card work? And will they take Hong Kong dollars? <laughs> oh yeah, they didn't ask. I, did. <laughs> I hope they do. <laughs> so Jenny, first observations of Macau. So somebody's forcing Jay to use their service. This one right here. Very, very aggressive. <laughs> no, we didn't actually take them up on their offer since it's commonplace in Southeast Asia for people to be very aggressive with tourists to try to get business. Instead, we found the underpass and here we're just trying to get over so we can get to the buses. So we're eyeing to go to the MGM Grand Casino and we are trying to find their bus here since many hotels and casino, they actually offer free shuttle to go to their places. Well, it's a very good business tactic, right? It's just amazing to see that all their buses are fully electric, which is not a very common sight in the Philippines. And it's fully air conditioned as well. And yeah, look at us, me and Jay just taking selfies because we are very excited to be in Macau. <laughs> I thought it's Star Wars Casino. Star World. I know, I went broke. It does look like Europe though. The streets. It's a bit quiet. Yeah. It's crazy because the buildings in the street looks like Europe, but um. Oh, here at MGM. But with the Chinese characters, can you hold it? Down? We're now in Resorts World. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I don't belong here. Whose idea was this? We're inside the MGM yeah. building. So there's casino, hotel. It's not so rich. Jenny has too many rich friends. I don't know about that. She just likes to tag along. I'm just tagging along. Though. And that contribute to the bill. What, 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 what? Whoa. What the? Oh my god. Whoa. What? Galing, galing. I think I found it. <laughs> this one. This? Five star. Wow. Hello, Rish. Is the place you want? I'm not sure. Oh, is this Imperial? Oh, Imperial Court. Are they braced? Sir, can we just watch you eat? <laughs> and we just watch Look, it's a brunch. Mm -hmm. I'll just watch you eat. I'm good with free, too big, and beverages at the casino. Two nine. 
Let's see what the price. <laughs> Two nine per person. This is a round trip ticket. Round trip ticket to LA. I re would rather go to LA and have In-N-Out Burger instead. <laughs> yeah, me too. I'm good, bro. I'm just gonna watch her eat, to be honest. I'm gonna go back to the casino and get my free beverages. By the way, I got the free card. So I didn't know this. It was my first time going into the casino, right? So apparently you have to get their card and then you can already get their beverages inside. So coffee, unlimited? tea, yeah, unlimited. Wow.